Here we go. We have Trip Advisors, T R I P, in the after hours using 30 minute candles. They just released their quarterly report. We were up here uh, at $53 and some change. And the minute that they released it in the after hours market, we hit $47 per share. And I will also put this on a 15 minute view. And we just want to let people know one thing is how do we trade these after hour markets and how do we take advantage of the option market expiration Friday and this is how we do it. We get $47 on the low. The next right thing is how do we buy it cheaper down here compared to the public that owned it at $53 today and that we're going to release the numbers. So the TripAdvisor earnings is an earnings mover. They are down initially right now down to that uh, minus 10%. That equaled, that 10% drop equaled that $47 price target on TripAdvisors. And we're going to learn more about the earnings. And does TripAdvisors as a sector that Priceline and Expedia is in, what kind of effect that they will have on the sector in general? Well, here's what we have on the TripAdvisors is targeting uh, double-digit consolidated uh, revenue growth in 2017, driven by a return to double-digit click-based and transaction revenue growth, while absolute adjusted to EBITDA could be flat to down year over year. And at that particular time, at 52.70, which is the high end of the bar, is, is that the guidance of what they have to say is not favorable for the bull, that's for sure. So that means that this trade sets up in the morning for a short, and we will be looking at the $50 put options to trade in the morning, and I'm going to show those right now. So this right. is the $50 put chart that we're going to trade tomorrow. It was up here at $1.70, and we're going to look to see um in the opening bell because as you can see trp 47 dollars is a low this is a 51 dollar put chart on on the name so tomorrow when trip tries to go higher and then as it rolls over we're going to buy 100 contracts out of here for a ten thousand dollar trade on trip